other news, you could soon spot the Salvation Army bell ringers out in front of some city streets. This is interesting. It's a major change to the group's iconic Red Kettle fundraiser launching two months earlier than ever before. The Rescue Christmas campaign is aimed at meeting what the group calls an unprecedented need due to the pandemic. And are you ready for some Krispy Kreme in your life? Well, their new Times Square flagship store opens later today. The shop features the world's largest hot light, you know, that keeps the donuts hot. Or that tells you the donuts are hot, excuse me. The largest glazed waterfall for spectators to watch donuts get their signature coating. This is like a dream. There will also be a 24-hour street side pickup window where people can get fresh hot donuts as they walk by. Ah, uh, that sounds good. Krispy Kreme for breakfast, anyone? Well, new sales figures show retro records beat out CDs in the first half of the year, and that has not happened since the 80s. Sales for the old school format brought in about $230 million, almost doubling CD sales. Of course, streaming is still king. People dropped about $4.8 billion on that in the first six months of 2020. How do you take your music, Bivin? Do you stream it? Are you still into CDs or cassette tapes? No, I'm not Maybe into you're a record guy. No, I, 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 I stream it. Uh, do you own any records? Have you ever owned any records? I actually do own records and I have them. I have this cool vintage <laughs> record player. It is, it is kind of a neat way to listen to music, I gotta say. It is. I have an old Dolly Parton record still, 45. That's right. <laughs>